Meanwhile, in San Antonio, Texas, the women's NCAA tournament tips off today. The Bradley Braves play their first ever NCAA tournament game tomorrow. The 11 seed Braves have spent the last several days practicing and working out in San Antonio ahead of Monday's game against the six seed Texas Longhorns. A big key to the contest will be if Bradley can stop this woman, Texas All American Charlie Collier, the six foot five forward, is expected to be the number one pick in this year's WNBA draft. In terms of how we're going to slow down Collier, she's she's going to be a handful, um, you know, and at the same time contain contain their guards and playing fast but not playing rush. I think that's going to be the key. I think um, the momentum from the tournament will hopefully carry over. It kind of carried over in practice today. And I think it will carry over into our game. Playing at Texas and just being here, I think the atmosphere will give us a little more motivation. Bradley versus Texas in the NCAA tournament, a 7 p.m. tip-off Monday on ESPN2. Best of luck to the Braves. Top five showdown at ICC today. The number three ICC women host fifth-ranked Parkland, and the Cougars dominate the third quarter, outscoring Parkland 25 to two. That was Kayla Gordon, two of her 10 points. Peoria High Product Shakora Metz going to run the floor, gets rewarded with the pass, scores off glass. Then it's Morton's Courtney Jones with a bullet pass ahead to Richwood's product Nia Williams. ICC pulls away and wins at 77-46.